Welcome to a guided meditative journey for the spring equinox to help you bring light and growth to the life that you most desire. My name is Amy Patti and I am your guide. And for this meditative journey today, I highly recommend just lying down and making yourself really comfortable. And once you are set up, go ahead and just let your eyes come to close and take a nice deep breath in through the nose. And as you breathe out, just let your entire body begin to sink down into whatever you're resting on. And go ahead and repeat that a couple more times. So just breathing in nice and deeply, filling up your body with this fresh oxygen and energy, and then breathing out the stress and tension and feeling the muscles of your body surrender. And just do that once more. Nice deep breath in. Breathing out, letting go. And then just be with your breath for a few moments, just the the ebb and flow of your inhalations and exhalations without any agenda to change the breath. Just be with the breath as it is in this moment. And now bring your awareness to the space right between the eyes. This is your third eye point, Ajna Chakra. And we're going to be working with the power of our imagination. We're going to be visualizing ourselves on a journey today to work with the energy of the spring equinox and the abundance of light that's beginning to return to the northern hemisphere in the end of winter. And this really fruitful time for planting seeds, and nourishing what it is that we most want to create in our lives. So as you shift your inner gaze to that space between the eyebrows, I want you to begin looking right through your forehead. It's like you're looking through your forehead into the space out in front of your forehead. And that's the place that we're going to begin to visualize ourselves. And I'd like you to visualize yourself out in nature. And I want you to pick your most favorite place in nature to be. So for some of you, it might be by the ocean or a lake. For some of you, maybe it's in a grassy meadow or on top of a mountain. What's your favorite place in nature to be? And I want you to just begin to visualize yourself there. And wherever you end up, you're going to still be lying down in this wonderful, comfortable position that you've chosen. And just taking in the elements of this place. Taking in the smells, the sounds, the feeling of the earth beneath you. And taking in the sights. What do you see around you? What's stimulating your senses in this moment? And just let yourself breathe that all in and just feel how this place comforts you. It makes you even more comfortable. It makes you feel good. Feeling the healing medicine that nature offers you. And just taking that in, beginning to soften and become a little bit more receptive to the healing vibrations of this natural place that you've chosen. And then I want you to see how brightly the sun is shining upon you here. Maybe you've got sunglasses on because the sun is so bright. Maybe you can feel the warmth of the sun on your skin. And 
And just like the plants are fed by sunlight, we too are fed by sunlight. We take in vitamin D from the sun, negative energy can be transmuted by the sun. We often feel energized and uplifted by the sunshine. So I want you to feel yourself just soaking up at the sun right now. Imagine the sun penetrating your skin and imagine how your cells, the cells of your body, absorb the nutrients from the sun and see if you can actually feel this process taking place inside of you right now. It's like you're just soaking up as much light as possible. You might even imagine that your body begins to glow like the sun. Notice your breath as you're receiving this warm nourishment from the sun. And feel all parts of your body soaking up the sun's rays. Notice your mood, right? Your emotional state might shift a little just by feeling the generosity from the sun. Now from this really filled up place, I want you to begin to think very clearly about something that you want to create in your life. It could be a romantic relationship, it could be a new living situation, a new job, financial stability, it could be a healthier version of you. Maybe you want to lose some weight or start an exercise routine. Think about something that you really, really deeply desire. And you're still laying here in this beautiful, natural setting. The sun is still shining upon you as you're imagining this thing, this desire that you have, imagining what it might be like for it to come into fruition in your life. A nice deep breath in, just feeling this desire fully. Breathing out completely. And now I'd like you to sit up in your mind's eye. You can keep laying down in real life, but sit up in your mind's eye and begin to look around. And as you're looking around, you're going to see sort of off to the side a little paper container. And it kind of catches your eye because it's bright um, in colors and, and it seems a little out of place. Um, there's, you know, you're surrounded by nature, but then here's this, this paper object off to the side. So you reach over and grab it and notice that it's a little packet of seeds. And just take it in for a moment. Notice the shape, the size, the colors, the texture of the package. If there's any words on the package, notice what they say. And you might feel even a sense of joy in your heart because there's this realization that these, this packet of seeds is for you and it symbolizes this desire that you hold inside of you. And the universe brought it to you so that you could plant the seed of desire in this nutrient-rich, sun-bathed patch of earth in your favorite natural place. This is the art of co-creating with the universe. 
So your job now is to open up this seed packet, empty out the seeds, hold them in your hand for a moment. And once again, just think about what it is that you most desire and feel that in your body. And infuse these seeds with your intention, with your desire. Let them feel how badly you want this to come to fruition. And as you're doing that, the seeds are being programmed. It's like the DNA of these seeds are being programmed to manifest, to grow in the real world what it is that you want. And when that feels complete for you, look around and find a spot where you can use your hands to dig out some soil, dig out some dirt, and plant these seeds. Plant your desires in this fertile earth bathed by sun. Breathing deeply as you're engaging in this process. And once these seeds are planted, if there's anything else you feel drawn to do in this setting, feel free to do that. You are the master of this space, so if you want to conjure up a watering pot to water your seeds, you can do that. You are in charge. And when everything feels finalized, your seeds are planted and you feel happy about how this is all taking place, you're going to lie back down and just allow yourself to breathe and relax again. Trusting in this co-creation process with the universe, with Mother Earth. Trusting that your desires matter and they will grow and come to fruition. Take three deep breaths, breathing in through the nose. If you feel inclined to just breathe out through the mouth, go ahead. Take one more nice deep breath in through the nose, out through the mouth. Letting go of this special place, letting go of your desires, letting go of this journey and coming back fully into your body in the here and now. Maybe wiggling your fingers and toes, letting your head rock a little side to side. And then just placing both hands right over your heart space and say thank you. Say thank you to your own heart. Say thank you to your desires. Thank you to yourself for showing up for this special meditative journey today. Saying thank you to the universe for co-creating with you, for hearing what your desires are. Thank you to Mother Earth for providing you with nature, which is so deeply healing, regenerative, and a place that allows us to grow, to be nourished and to grow. Take one more nice deep breath right into your heart space, right into all that gratitude energy. Breathing out, letting it all go. Thank you so much for joining me for this meditation. Happy spring equinox. Namaste.